Carolina from the grandma today. I'm back with another video and I'm here with the special guest, Diamond. Follow me on Instagram. Period. And today we here to do a story time. We here to do a story time Flash. and a mukbang snack. And we're gonna be doing um a story time when we snuck out. And we almost got kidnapped. So at the same time. Yeah. So we're gonna be giving y'all the rundown. Hopefully she give the rundown too because she be when she eats, she eats. I do. Can you open these chips? Sorry. It says doing. king size. And these ain't even king size. What did you this? say? I don't know. I don't see. I don't care. Mm -hmm. These not even what? King size my ass. Okay. So we're gonna tell how y'all how this happened. So boom. I went to her house. We was finna spend the night. She was finna spend the night. Yeah, I was finna spend the night at her house. And first we walked to this one girl house because we was finna fight her. Right around the corner. Cause we didn't like her and she had her friends and remember all of them was texting us yeah one of them was all of them was texting us off this account so weird we went up because they live right across the street i mean around the corner and we went So we had locked over there and we went live telling her to come outside. Her and all them girls that she was with to come outside. Mm -hmm. They didn't want to come outside and it was already late at night. It was already late at night. So we was like, okay, we're gonna just leave. So, so we left. And then um we left and then we was bored because we had got all dressed up and stuff. Cause I don't know why we got dressed up. I wanted to be cute to fight if I was gonna fight. So, boom, we got to the house or whatever. And I was talking to this one boy. What well, I was with this one boy. Yeah. He's so toxic. But I was with this one boy, and we gonna call him CJ. We gonna call him CJ. So, I hope your loud ass crunching don't take out. Mm. <laughs> So I was with this boy named CJ or whatever, and he was like a real hood dude, like he mm. good. So I don't know. He was like, "Let me pull up on you. Let me come pick you up or whatever." I was like, "No, you're not gonna pull up on me." And he was like, "Why?" And I was like, "Cause that car probably not even yours." He was like, "Nah, my homegirl." Bro, we was scared. Yeah, cause if it was a stolen car, cause he always get locked up for stolen cars. So. He was like, um, he was like, it ain't no stolen car. My homeboy. I don't know. He made up an excuse and it sounded accurate. So I was like, all right. So then we was like, we wanted to send the address. We wanted to send messages, but we didn't want to at the same time. No, we so we didn't want him to pull up because we, we snuck out. Mm -hmm. So, so the, um, he basically just pulled up on the main street. On the main street, we were scared. <laughs> I was scared to get in that car <laughs> because it was right in front of our street. We didn't know if I could be walking outside or just anything. So we was like, okay. And so he was like, girl, if you gonna bring your ass in the car, like, <laughs> <laughs> and then we were having a hard he time. was like, girl, come on. But he was like, girl, come on. Don't nobody got, he had this loud ass music. And, and then it, it was, was a, two, it was like three niggas in the back. <laughs> and I had to sit back there. She had to sit in the back. One of the dudes was in the front. And two of them was in the back. But back. he made 
one of them get to the back yeah. because he wouldn't be to be in the front. And then I was like, can she sit in the front? With yeah, me? we were trying to sit we in the front. We were trying to sit in the front together. together. <laughs> but if y'all know what type of dude he is, he was like very controlling. So he was like, nah. She so I had back. to sit in back with a nigga, and I didn't want to. And all the niggas are trying to talk to her, and she was so uncomfortable. And I turned around, I was like, she's uncomfortable. Can she sit in the front with me? He was like, I was she going to be all right? He said, because if anybody try to do something, I'm going to shoot their ass. So she going to be all right. So I was like, all right, you better be motherfucking trigger happy, and you better motherfucking use it when I motherfucking tell you to. And I was like, so she was already mad. Mm, okay, so I was in the back. And we wanted to stay in the neighborhood. <laughs> and he kept on saying, I didn't come all the way over here to drive around the neighborhood. <laughs> so we was like, so? And he left the neighborhood. <laughs> so we was scared. Was no. <laughs> this is funny. So. Hold on. Me hugging a car or whatever. That's why she was in the backseat or whatever. And we thought we was gonna just drive around the neighborhood or whatever. But no. He was like, I ain't come all the way over here. I just be driving around the neighborhood. All this stuff. I was like, so you, you still finna stay in the neighborhood? He was like, no, I'm not. And I was like, I'm finna get out. And he kept doing this. Oh. He was like, no. <laughs> we were trying to get out the car. He hit child lock in the back so she can leave. Really I was like, bro, what's And then he locked the door and he started speeding fast so I couldn't get up. And then he kept grabbing me and we was kind of like fighting. We were scared. And so. Remember dad had caught and I told him to turn the music on? So yeah, he had his child like in the back so she couldn't get out in the back. And then every time I tried, kept trying to get out, he would keep grabbing me. See, I'm so glad I'm out that toxic relationship. But me he too. kept grabbing me and that nigga kept grabbing me hard and like slinging me. Like, no. no. She over here trying to get out the car. And I was like, boy, no. And then he put, and then I kept moving. Me and him kept arguing. So he had the little gun right there. And I seen it. I said, oh, no, because you understand. And he lied. It was a stolen car, too. He had a gun and, and a gun in there and some weed in there. He had everything. Like, what if we got pulled over? We That's what together. I was really scared of because this side of town be hot. So I was like, no. I said, uh-uh. And I kept. We all was finna whip this bit. We was all finna crash because me and him was fighting. <laughs> and so then dad started calling her phone. Mm -hmm. I could turn the music loud. And he had the music loud. Every time I kept talking, he would turn the music loud so he wouldn't hear me talk. And dad had called the phone. <laughs> so I said, hold on, our dad calling. He said, the answer. <laughs> <laughs> No, he don't know. I don't think he knew that. He we didn't snuck know out. we left. That's why he was calling. But um, CJ didn't know we snuck out. So oh, that's yeah. why he was like, didn't answer. Mm -hmm. So we was like, no, turn the music down and everybody got to get quiet because it was all loud and shit. Mm -hmm. So then, boom, he just like, um, <laughs> he was like, where you at? I thought he saw us through the car. Because he would have stopped us though. Mm -hmm. He would have followed the car. No. Mm -hmm. But I'm over here thinking he saw the car or whatever because he just called randomly. Usually he'll text and then call. Mm -hmm. But he just called randomly. And we was like, so then we get off the phone, hung up, and this is when we driving at the uh, neighborhood. Cause the neighborhood is a big neighborhood. Mm -hmm. Tell me why. Next thing you know, he gonna go. <laughs> he start going out the neighborhood and Bro, he start hitting the highway. That's when, that's when I was scared. I was like, I no, was like, turn Bro, around. I'm not gonna do this. I'm not gonna to do this. He home. kept getting, he kept getting the gun and waving it, and he will shoot. Please take us back. I was I'm like, uh, get this. <laughs> I wanted to cry, baby. <laughs> she wanted to cry. Tell me why she gonna, she gonna, uh, cause I'm in the front, she in the back seat, but she right behind me. She gonna tap me. She said, bitch, tell him to turn this car. <laughs> she was quiet the whole ride, but she was like, bitch. <laughs> Y'all don't understand the, the 
fucking horror I had in my <laughs> Bro, he was like, we was like, where we finna go? Where we finna go? He said, we finna go to my, um, we finna go to my section. We finna go to my section. I said, no, we not finna go to your section. You better turn this car around. And he kept getting that gun, and I kept, I was like, cause every time he pulled it out, I shut up, cause I was scared. And so she, go, um, she was like. She tapped me. She said, bitch, tell him to turn this car around. I said, bitch, I'm trying to tell no, him. I, I thought he, he wasn't like, going to turn around. I thought he wasn't even going to take it. I had to lie. I was like, um, you could come get us tomorrow and throughout the day. And then we could chill in and stuff. And we'll go over there. And then first he wasn't going for it because he went all the way down. Like, all the way down. And I was like, come on. And I kept being. So then that's when. He started flashing that gun again, and I stopped, I stopped giving a fuck, and I was like, and I just kept fighting him back. So then, he, he, know, he, know the, he knew that that gun wasn't finna scare me, and then we was passing up the school, and the school had a little cop right there, so that's when he turned around, and he was like, all right, man, all, all right, and so then he got mad. He was mad, like quiet, when he was taking us back. But his friends, one of them was my play brother. She was always, and so he was cool on it. But we went home though, and so. But he dropped us off like two streets over. Yeah, he dropped us off two streets over because we was two streets over, and we walked the rest. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that night was crazy, and I was scared. Moral of the story is, if he hood and toxic, that's not what you want. Just stay at home. I was regretting it the whole time. Bro, I thought we was just going to drive all around the neighborhood and just chill. But nah, he was on some other stuff. So we finna go to my section. What the fuck is your section? <laughs> For real? Like, the fuck? <laughs> Where's that finna be at? But yeah, that's the end of this video. Please like, share, subscribe. And if y'all want her social medias and stuff, it's going to be in the link in the description box below. Just follow me on Instagram. That's it. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> and that's it. Bye. See y'all next time.